Hi there and welcome to Mining 901. I'm Abu Rengui. Today we're talking geology, the foundation of every successful mining project. And joining us is Relibuki Lemakema, consultant geologist at BNS Geological, one of South Africa's leading geological consulting firms. For years, BNS Geological has built a strong reputation for delivering high-quality geological services, from exploration support and resource evaluation to data management and compliance reporting. Their work spans multiple commodities and project stages, and they are known for combining technical accuracy with practical, real-world solutions that help mining companies make smarter decisions. With an MSc in Economic Geology, Rilibukhile brings both technical expertise and hands-on field experience, giving us insight into how BNS Geological supports its clients, adapts to new technologies, and uses modern tools to improve geological data management. If you're curious about how geology and technology are evolving together, you won't want to miss this conversation. So with that, let's get started. Welcome, Rilibukhile. Uh, thank you. Thank you for having me, uh, Aborengue, and thank you for that brilliant introduction. Now, I'm actually quite excited that today we really get to deep dive into geology, and I couldn't imagine a better company to have this conversation with than BNS Geological, as mentioned, one of SA's, if not Africa's, leading geological services companies. Uh, who are you? What do you do? And what, are, what sort of uh, sectors and commodities do you guys cover? So we are a geological services provider, and we are now technical experts in the suit of sequence software, such as MX Deposit. The current services that we offer, in addition to the software sales, is geological consulting, technical support, training, mentorship, as well as implementation. We, we primarily serve the exploration and and the mining industry, mostly focusing on geological technology solutions. We are an authorized sequence channel partner, and we ensure expert implementation, training, as well as support. We've implemented technology a lot uh, into our normal day-to-day -day work. And of course, ex as experts in the, the, the sequence suit of products, covering data collection, analysis, 3D visualization, modeling, all the way to, to resource estimations. It essentially affords us to work much faster and then it helps us uh, to collect data and also it enables better decision making. As I was preparing for this conversation, I went on your website and then I sort of stumbled across one of the tools that you guys uh, are using, MX Deposit. What is it and how does it improve the way exploration teams collect, manage, and analyze drill hole and sample data? MX Deposit is a robust database management software designed for secure geological data capture as well as storage. One of its key advantages is its cost effectiveness and ease of implementation, making it an accessible solution for exploration as well as um, mining companies. The platform supports multiple uh, activities. So you can essentially log within the database as well as do your, your, your point sampling, geotechnical, hydro, and many more. And a major strength of MX Deposit is its intuitive design, making it easy to configure, set up, as well as use. In that it's very intuitive and it has a very user-friendly user-friendly platform while meeting industry standards. Uh, what has been your experience in terms of how geos are engaging with the tool? Its key advantages is lies in its ability to be installed on handheld devices such as tablets, which allows geologists to work offline in remote areas with unreliable internet connectivity. So what this means is that when you're offline, the software caches uh, data locally, ensuring uninterrupted uh, data capture once the device regains internet access, it prompts the user to sync and securely upload the data onto the cloud. And a major um, 
benefit of MX deposit is in its structure and controlled data capture process. You find that individuals have historical data in Excel format. And whenever we try to bring in this data into MX deposit, there's often a lot of errors in the data. What happens with MX deposit and why it's so powerful, it has an error validation. So it, it actually validates the data. As, as a geologist yourself, Abirengu, you know how catastrophic data that's invalid data could be to the entire operation and ultimately grade estimations, resource estimations, and the, the entire reporting of your resource. And then another key strength of MX Deposit is in its structured approach to QAQC workflows. So when you're capturing sampling data, the system intelligently prompts the user based on the sample type. Right. So no. let's say, for example, if uh, a sample is marked as an original, it requires a primary sample ID. And let's say if it's a field duplicate, the system prompts for both the original sample ID and the duplicate ID. It, it essentially induces efficiency into your operation. You can have the ability to collect, store and manage your data. So you can define the different lithologies, add colors, add stratigraphy, add symbology. And then one other nice feature that, that, that is incorporated into MX Deposit is the ability for you to actually see your, your mining area as well as your drill holes in plain view on Google Maps or Esri, so which is essentially very great. So because MX Deposit is cloud-based, rolling it out across multiple projects and teams is seamless. It reduces deployment costs and complexity, right? So user management is highly flexible. You can break up MX to deposit into two components. You have the user phase and then you have the administrator phase. So now this is where the security comes in. So what happens is that you can assign an administrator that essentially oversees everything. So this person has the ability to configure tables as well as add lists and so on and so forth. A user, just a normal user, doesn't have the capacity to configure the database or make any changes. The only thing that they have the capacity to do is to just log data into the software. After watching this, I'm a geologist uh, sitting at some gold mine in Tanzania, or maybe I'm in Mozambique and I'm listening to this and I'm thinking, this MX deposit sounds very interesting. I've had a beautiful experience with LeapFrog previously. I want to implement MX Deposit on my site. What does that process look like, Arulewokila, the implementation process from the moment someone gets in touch with BNS Geological to, I suppose, the very first time that we get to enter our geological data into a functioning database? So the implementation process begins with a, an initial consultation to assess whether the client has an existing database or is starting a new project. We work closely with geologists and project stakeholders to develop the specific geological data that needs to be captured, defining key parameters such as data structure, workflows, as well as the, the user roles. So once the database design is outlined, we present it to the client for review, ensuring that our understanding aligns with project requirements. We then liaise with development with the development team uh, from sequent to validate that the configuration is fully compatible with MX deposits capabilities. So after client's approval, we proceed with uh, system configurations, setting up tables, validation rules, as well as workflows. A preliminary model is created, uh, including sample boreholes and test data sets. So this is just to verify functionality before full-scale deployment. You can maintain the software going forward, or you can just keep us in the loop. So we also provide mentorship and guidance to you and to make sure that you are fully vested in, 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 in MX Deposit. In terms of pricing and implementation costs, uh, we can just discuss that during our sessions and additional resources, including instructional videos, if uh, you want to go and explore more about MX Deposits, those are all available on the Sequin website. Uh, what would you say would be the key reasons why I should consider getting MX Deposit to replace what I may uh, already be using on site? The reason that we, we, we work so hard to promote MX Deposit is, is, that, is because we really believe it can combat the current challenges with the existing database 
uh, management softwares. Firstly, uh, the software provides centralized storage of geological sampling as well as drilling data, thus ensuring project information is accessible and organized in one platform. Okay. And then lastly, the software uh, possesses built-in reporting tools that essentially streamline report generation and enable quick data-driven insights, which things like Excel or even uh, Microsoft Access cannot uh, essentially do or other softwares. If I am really serious about getting MX deposit and I want to get hold of BNS Geological, what's the best way to get hold of you? You can get a hold of us uh, via our email. So that would be info at bnsgeo.co.za or through our website or even through our, our LinkedIn page. Alternatively, you can also directly contact me. So my email would be relepuhile.mahema at bnsgeo.co.za. Relepuhile, thank you. You see the email address at the bottom of the screen. We'll also include it in the descriptions. This has been Mining 901, a deep dive into a geological management tool, MX Deposit, brought to you by BNS Geological. So if you find this interesting and you have a database challenge on your site, at least now you know where to go. Really, Wokile, thank you for availing yourself to Mining 901 and really for taking us through the work that you do. We really appreciate your time. Thank you, Abu Thank you for having me.